This flight pattern here is robbing. It's not a swarm. Might look kind of like it. But there's honey in the back of my truck. If you'll watch the bees, they approach the hive carefully. They don't just go straight in like they're returning from a foraging trip. And then they hurry home once they got the goods. You'll see sticky on the outside of the hive. When bees rob, they get honey all over their feet. So they've got to stand somewhere for a while and clean themselves up before they take off. It's early spring. So robbing usually happens in the fall, but early spring before there's any blossoms out, they'll rob also. All these bees in, that are robbing here are from my bee yards, but still there's gonna be a lot of casualties. They sting each other and fight and wrestle when they're robbing. Here's a close-up of some robbing behavior. You'll see bees wrestling with each other. So what is robbing? Robbing is bees that are, robbing is foraging that's gone bad, right? So the bees want something to do. They're bringing in resources to the hive, but there's no nectar out. In other words, there's no flowers with fresh nectar. It's a time of year, in this case, early spring. Uh, robbing also occurs mostly in the fall after the blossoms on the flowers are done. So uh, that's what robbing is, is bees that are out. There's sufficiently warm enough weather for them to fly and they're out looking for something to do. And when they don't find any flowers, they rob other colonies for honey. They'll also rob your, your uh, jams and jellies and rotten fruit. <laughs> so if you're canning fruit in the fall in the kitchen with the window open and some bees come over to investigate what you're doing, they're looking for something to rob. So what happens when a bee robs the hive? Like how can you tell it's robbing? Uh, we, you'll get a real good picture of taking these frames out over here at the truck. Do you want them? When I take a frame out, the bees boil out of there, and you can tell by their flight pattern whether they're robbing or not. There's, that's one way. Don't be intimidated about getting those bees up there. I don't need to go for my bee brush. They know they're not supposed to be there, so they're going to scatter. If these, if this was a hive out of the, if this was a frame out of the hive that these bees belonged into, they'd hang on there, right? But since they're robbers, they're going to disperse right away. They get scattered and run away real quick. Right. So I don't want these bees on here because they're not from a hive that, well, they might be from the hive that I'm gonna put it in, but probably not. I've got 15 hives in this apiary, so we don't know. So I'll get the bees off so they don't fight with the other bees when I put them in the colony. Here's another indication of robbing. If you see this, uh, and the bees in their hurry to uncap the cells, and some of this, this honey in here is crystallized, and so it's hard for them to pick up Right, so they leave a bunch of mess behind and there's a bunch of dead bees. These are the bees that are fighting from different colonies over the territory of, the, of that honey. So robbing for several reasons is not a good thing. We want to prevent it from happening because a lot of the bees die when they're robbing. So what would I do about this right now, this time of night? I'm gonna let these bees go home. They're going home right now because it's almost dark. And then I'll take the uh, frames the boxes out of this truck and I'll put them in the shed put them somewhere where they uh, won't rob tomorrow because those bees in the morning are going to come right back to this spot and say hey where did all that uh, nectar source go where did all that honey go uh, and it'll be somewhere bee tight safe away from the bees usually this time of evening the bees have been a little bit more settled down so here's another sign of robbing only the robbing's going on elsewhere but you can see the bees are a little bit uh, unsettled at the porch usually they're in the hive by this time of the evening and settle down so there's more guard bees on duty because there's robbing in the air and that's why we're seeing this late in the evening this kind of activity <laughs> 